A major push tonight to make Cincinnati, in the words of the mayor, a Statue of Liberty City. Mayor John Cranley sees immigration as good for growth, and we apparently have some growing to do. WLWT News Vice John London joining us now live from the newsroom with how much catching up we have ahead of us. Hi, John. Well, Sheree, we're the last sizable Ohio city to start a welcome center, and it's only now, 15 months after forming a task force, that real dollars have been committed to support the talk. Arriving from the Congo four years ago, Condre Kabanga spoke only French, no English. He had not yet made contact with Cincinnati State, where he is about to graduate. And I start, you know, little by little, making some connection, like, you know, from church or, you know, meeting some different people with kindness and they just don't you know, want to help me. Today, help for immigrants. So, Mr. Mayor, Mr. Mayor, thank you. Thank you. Got a hand from Mayor Cranley's task force. Among the 21 suggestions, create a one-stop center for new Cincinnatians and fund it jointly with UC, the Chamber, and various grants. Condre wishes the city had done this years ago. Scores of other cities already have welcome centers and immigrant websites. Condre is in a city ranking low in foreign-born, second language, and issuing passports. If you put those things together, we're not looking out, we're just looking in. The head of the Hispanic Chamber saying we're late to this dance. If we're going to have a, re a region that is growing, somehow we need to attract more people and bring more people. Condre, who is pursuing computer technology, considers this city cool and likes both the physical and symbolic aspects of the mayor's stance on immigration. Obviously, there's political rhetoric around the country that suggests that it's not a good thing. We are emphatically saying we love immigration. We want more immigration. We believe that it's uh, key to our economic future uh, and to a better, more just society. One of the very first things Condre learned here, you better get some wheels. If you don't have a car, so you, you can't go nowhere. Now, there is nothing specific in the plan about undocumented workers. The Archdiocese is working on identif identification cards for them. Mayor Cranley saying the city will not issue IDs, but will accept for municipal purposes the IDs that Catholic Charities come up with. Cherie? London Life Force tonight, John. Thank you. The mayor expects council to approve $50,000 a year towards establishing that immigrant welcome center within the next two years.